Welcome back to Unreal World Mackenzie. Sorry for the abrupt ending of the last episode. We're looking for yellow finger mushrooms, I think they're called, so that we can do this. Um, and we're looking for we're heading back to our main camp, but we're going by the scenic route because we can't get through this lake uh, to get back up here to central base. Um, and we're letting our dog eat for a little bit, but Thank you. I think it's time to go. Okay, it's time to go. We bookmarked a uh, a raven. the way back there. Um, I guess we're going to be able to explore some of this. Anyway, here we go. It's late morning and we are lively and we're doing five miles an hour. So that's the good part. Actually, I want to go to this mountain over here. Should have done this on the way, but okay. So we cleared up that. Coarse mushrooms. Uh, let's pretend that we've just done herblore on them. I'm not certain. More coarse mushrooms, yes. Oh, here we go. Oh, no. Two days? A day? Found them. Awesome. So that will finish this. So we will even drop our stuff to do this. And feed the dog. Even if he's by a sapling, which he's not. So we pick this and we got a harvest. So there's a, there's a tip. If you're trying to do this in spring, yellow fingers, mushroom, yellow finger mushrooms. So now we have to find a sauna. And um, heat up the sauna for several hours and then t take off your clothes, pick up the tub of water and apply it beside the sauna stove. 
And then after that is the trap fence, which is a bit of a pain in the butt. Not too much of a pain in the butt, but a bit of one. So we'll eat some mushrooms and let the dog eat once. and call it and this was in a coniferous forest that we found the mushrooms so there you go What's that? It's a hair. Don't really have any use for a hair at the moment. We're still lively. It's noon. We found another village over here. And another. So let's see if there's anything good here. Masterwork linen trousers. Okay, so we can compare these again. Zero one zero two two two. And these are zero one zero two two four. So it's just a difference of warmth. Hmm. How really worth it. Some male leggings here. 23 pounds though but this is what protection looks like two four two seven six two two four two seven six two really good against edge and tear and quite good against point but 23 pounds. Hmm. Oops. All right, let's do it from south to north. Or, or roughly do it like that. Fine woolen dress. No, thank you. There's a sauna.
The sauna task talks about firewood. And I think that's how I'm going to make the quest kind of a little bit harder and a little bit more. Like if I'm going to go use the sauna for these people, they're not going to be too happy if I drag in a, a big slender trunk from out of the forest, I don't think. You know, at least be a little bit civilized. Use proper firewood. And even though I consider firewood generally to be a waste, in this case I will, I will make some firewood. I will do the blocks and then the firewood and do the bit. Drop everything. Where's the dog? Feed the dog. Eat some, eat some, no, do some herb lore. Did I, I ate all those mushrooms, right? I think so, yeah. And let the dog eat one more. Okay. Then call the dog off the bone. Tell this old man to stop following me. Oh crap. Never mind, old man. You're 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 in your village, that's okay. <clears throat> Can we get through here? My guess is no. Oh. It looks to be a way through. Let's confirm that it is in reality. Usually the land bridge takes precedence over the water bridge. And it does in this case. <sighs> no use for a squirrel. No. Let's see if there were more mushrooms here. This is kind of a gray area, but I would consider that the belonging to the village. another village talk to the sage Fine spear. If mine gets damaged. Oh crap, that reminds me, we've we've got that um iron spectacle helm that we were supposed to to get. How do we forget that? Hmm. Yeah, I was there to talk to the guy and I never did. I 
got sidetracked on the quest, I think. Masterwork linen undershirt. But we've done this already, right? Oh no. So let's compare the three pounds and the five pounds. Three pounds is zero one zero two two four. And the five pounds is Two, one, one, two, two, three. So it's a lot better against blunt. It's a two instead of a zero. It's the same against point. And it's one better against squeeze. And it's the same against edge, the same against tear and one not as good against warm or against the cold. <clears throat> I just don't know. Anyway, we're not going to buy it now. But I guess we should make a note. Talk to this guy. No. Okay. I talked to this guy, right? Yes. Okay, um, let's go. Getting pretty hungry, we're getting a bit tired. I think we're finally across this big lake. There's another village. There's a cave.
another fine spear. I forgot to label the other one, I think, but I'll label this one. I prefer a fine spear because the masterwork spears tend to ruin the skins. I use the spears primarily against bears or wolves. Whereas a javelin won't bring them down quickly enough before they start really hurting me. Yeah, talk to you already. Another fine spear. He had a long bow, but just a regular one. Fine quality blacksmith. Okay, time to go. So let's try to figure out where we are. We're weary. And we're not far from, quote unquote, home it's to the west. So we will knock out this black. Really? Oh, well, whatever. We didn't leave anything here, did we? No, but the nettle is coming in nicely. Let's see if the food we left here is spoiled, the roasted cuts. So we will feed the dog. Has he been here? I'm not certain. I don't think so. Oh, the food is still tasty. Not even stale. Very nice. Ooh. Cellar did its job. Excuse me. And we're still early seed time month, which is good. I wanted to get these seeds in the ground early in seed time month. We have four varieties of seeds. We don't have barley. Um, we'll do two rows of turnips one row of the others. So drop the furs where the furs go.
drop the bones in the cellar and drop everything else in a pile except for the seeds which we will now plant. So turnips first. We still have a hair here, though. Okay, that's enough turnips. Flax. Rye. Is it hemp we haven't done yet? Can you trap birds with seeds? Drop the seeds. The dog, I think, is eating. We'll give him another bone. He's probably pretty hungry because I interrupted him eating a few times. Let's see if it'll let me even do this. Drop the box, apply the loop snare. Pick up and trapping 
bait a trap. No, <laughs> see, that's not what I want. Um, Uh, just leave it alone. Go to sleep. I don't like that at all. <laughs> I don't like that at all. But... I'm not going to, I'm not going to say no. Because, you know, in real life, I'd be able to say, look, I need some berries if I'm going to trap a, uh, trap a bird at this time of year and there aren't any berries. Do you have any extra from last season in your cellar for me? And he'd say, sure, here's some. And say, great, I'll bring you a bird in a couple of days. Anyway. Not gonna let, look a gift bird in the in the mouth. Wait a second. Wait a s oh. Looking right at it. A couple of times and I still didn't see it. Let's eat this while it's still tasty. Okay, excuse me. Oh, the raven is off the hook. Oh, wow, I almost, <laughs> I almost blew it. I've got to bring him the carcass just like this. Okay, so. Oh, that would have been brutal.
Okay, we don't need two ropes with this. But we could use, or two javelins, really. We could use a woodsman's axe. And maybe a bit of hemp yarn. Okay. And we better tell the dog to come and bring a fresh bone for him. Hope there are turnips here. Maybe I've looked here before already and there aren't. I'll remember this time if there aren't. I don't think there are any in there, let's say. think so. It's a bunch of empty, empty places. Come on. They have some and now they're all gone because it's seed time month. Is that the deal? Annoying, 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 annoying. All right, try down here. We should talk to people just to. just to make them more familiar with me, and to be sociable, and blah, blah, blah. I don't think I saw any there. Yeah, are all the seeds gone? I you kind of have to buy them early, or or they're gone, or so it seems. Come on. 
Come on. You've got company. You can go back to sleep when company leaves. Ba -ba -bum. No turnips there. Man, if I had known the turnips were going to disappear, I would have picked up quite a few and thrown them in the cellar. Is there any turnips left anywhere? Please. Need to protect my crops from that that varmint. No more seeds. No more turnips. Okay, I'll just remember that for future games. Has to work broad knife. It used to be very exciting when you found that, but now it's like, oh, that's nice, but I've already got a master work. Um, a master blacksmith who does my my stuff for me. Grrr. Is that all of them? I'm sure the cuts will be stale by the time I get here. Are they? No, not yet. Barley flour. Moo. Bear cuts. I don't know why the game would be, would design it this way, just to sort of, if you're not, if you're not prepared ahead of time, you, you're out of luck, it's supposed to teach you that lesson. Peas and broad beans. I don't think I have either of those, actually. I've been to all the things. Is it stale now? Nope. All right, last chance. Don't follow me, please. about now? Oh. Well, I'm going to eat the cuts after I leave here, so... I should be talking to people. Just like a turnip. There were like 184 of them here yesterday. Where are they?
No. No. Oh well. Does it really matter if the hair destroys my crops at the end of the day or even at the beginning of the day? No, it doesn't. So let's go over here. Feed the dog. And eat that. Excuse me. Did I bring any furs? I didn't even bring any furs. I have to use my hood to trade if I actually do find some turnips. See, I wasn't supposed to go this far. But now I'm... But I still have the uh, bird on me, right? Yes, okay. Well, that's kind of the important thing. Let's go, dog. You can't spend all day eating. Did I not pick it up? Yes, I did. Or this one is the walled city. Maybe they will keep their turnips within their walls. with the two sages. So, yeah, I don't know when I'm going to be able to get more turnips. So let's see how many I can get for that hood. Halfway there, so... Let me think again. Pick up two turnips. Pleasantly close. Well, I don't think we're going to get any more turnips than we'd already agreed on. Just a few more things. Actually, let's negotiate with someone who might actually benefit from our hood, like this guy. Yeah, he has no hood. 
So So let's see if he puts it on. He put it on. That's great. That's cool. Thank you for the hood. You can have the village's turnips. Win-win for everyone. Okay. Uh, call the dog. Good dog. And... we go back and trap the hare or not? How far have we gone? Yeah, and, and put the turnips in the cellar. This was a pain in the butt, but it wasn't that far. We're still lively. It's still late morning. We haven't ruined the whole day. Um, feed the dog. Drop. Oh, it's still tasty. Wow. And come over here. Apply loop snare. Throw turnip. Steady throw. Okay. Okay, now we need to get moving with this dead bird before it rots. So call the dog. Wait, we'll have a drink. Nothing to eat. Um, so call the dog. Oh, who? Gotta get my furs. All of them? Oh, we're still doing five miles an hour, so I guess so. I'll pick this up. Okay. Yeah, whatever. Let's go. Don't run. Just relax. Enjoy the journey. Maybe you'll see a lynx. I bet you I've flashed a lynx that I missed at some point during this character's existence. Oh, 
Okay. So is this where I owe the guy? It's an old man that I owe the bird, right? Inside, just around the corner. Which corner was that? Oh, here? Yes, I'm a bird hunter of a sort. So you take three feathers that have remained from the stolen bird and throw them in the heated sauna stove after the fire has burnt out. You can also throw the feathers into remains of burnt out fire, which was made on base rock. Okay. And where's the blacksmith? Do I have any kind of change, though? Hmm. Maybe I'll use the rope as change. I feel badly because I ordered that stuff a while ago, or that thing a while ago. Uh, one of these, good start. Two of these, halfway. Pleasantly close. A few more things. Two forest, a fine forest, a fox. Two forest, a fine forest. Fox and a badger. And a rope. Two forest, a fine forest, a badger and a fox. Two forest, a fine forest. A f two fox. Two forest, a fine forest, two badgers. And a rope. And some hemp yarn. Two forest, a fine forest. This is why it's good to have exact change. Uh, badger and a fine hair. So a badger is worth more than a fine hair. Because two badgers was better than pleasantly close. Two forest, fine forest, and two badgers was just a few things. Fine hair. Rope. So...
two forest, a fine forest, a fox, and a fine hare. Two forest, fine forest, a fox, and a badger, and a rope. Two forest, a fine forest, a fox, a badger, and a fine hare. Two forest, a fine forest, a fox, and a badger. And a rope, no. Two forest, fine forest, fox, badger, fine, here it is. It serves me right for not bringing proper change. Let's see what I can do. I need food. Do you have any roasted food here? That would be ideal. That would give me some change. Buy my roasted elk cuts back. Is that what I'm going to do? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. I'm worried that they're going to spoil quickly, though. If I buy them back, they'll resume rotting wherever they were when I sold them. Yeah, I don't like that idea. Hmm. All right, we made the guy wait. Let's just close the deal. Two forests, a fine forest, a badger, and a fox fur. And he's going to say no, and we'll throw in a fine hare, and he'll say yes, and I'll say this is highway robbery, but whatever. Now we have a masterwork iron spectacle helm. and our head is protected, albeit at a fairly significant weight of three and a half pounds. Okay. Um, So let's go look for um,
the guy's campsite. It's not going to be easy in this snow. These, um... Okay, it stopped snowing good. We're going to look for uh, loop snares, and they're not very conspicuous. And he doesn't tell us anything, like about border location of large spruce mire right next to pine mire in the south. So, we're in a spruce mire. Is there a pine mire in the south? No, but here there is. Okay, here's the pine mire in the south. And see if we can... Yeah, this is even harder than my last game when it was in a... Hey, um, ah, oh, whatchamacallit. The ones that are tr trees, but they're not as densely packed with trees as this. Throw him a bone. Now the the loop snares are very hard to see, especially if there's any precipitation. Even for someone like me that is used to like clearing up clutter. Too bad this was like the number one um, the most likely possibility. I'll give him one more eat. Okay, one more. Come on, let's go. He's got such a big appetite. Okay, good. Didn't have to call him off the bone. But let's just try to make sure it's not here. There were three loop snares in the in the one I did in the, my last character in Wycliffe. Um, And there's no other evidence of a of a camp, so it's not easy to discern. They're just, and they're. It's not like they're full of feathers either, which is what I was kind of looking for. But there were two feathers next to one of them, and there might have been more next to others that I collected without realizing what I was doing. This game, I haven't really been picking up feathers, so I won't make that mistake this game.
Oh, it's raining. I guess it won't make that much of a difference. I, now that I know what to look for and that it is very subtle, Maybe if I don't see one, I'll get lucky and walk over one. And that'll wake me up. Heathland is is where that's what it's called, right? The the biome that I was trying to remember. Let's try over here. Are we still well within? Oh, not really. Never mind. This is prime territory. And I haven't looked here yet, I guess. Here we go. We found it. And there's two here and two here. And there's the loop snare. So let's try to find others. Those are the only feathers we've picked up. And we only needed three, and we've got four. Uh, feather 
thief sight. Oh, this is so much clearer than it was. Maybe they did the same thing the previous game, but boy, it sure didn't didn't seem like this to me. There's two more. And this is the way I, I kind of thought it would be. And when it wasn't, I was like, wow. And here's another one, super obvious. When I did it, I didn't find anything. And then when I came back and searched again, I found the loop snares with no feathers, except one had two feathers near it. But at the time, I was just compulsively picking up feathers, and I thought, well, maybe I just picked them up. There were only three loop snares there. You know, I can't be sure that I didn't miss some here, but what's the point? I've I've got all the feathers I need. So let's so we can do the sauna and then when the sauna's done we can um, do the quest. So we're killing two birds with one stone. And then it's on to trap fence. Which, yeah. Just reading this quest again. Is there any hunting we can do? Maybe if we explore down here, we'll find something to hunt. I'm hungry. <laughs> I don't have any food. And I don't want to trade my clothing for food. I'd rather just kill something and cook it. And not very much food. Well, it's something. Where's the squirrel? I don't see it. Maybe it'll squeak, it usually does. From the southeast.
No, this is stupid. You win, squirrel. Evening, we're weary. It's snowing, it's getting dark. There's a river in our way. All right, I'm extremely tired. I lost my dog. No, I didn't. Um, so we'll drop everything but our woodsman's axe, and we'll make a post spruce, and we'll go to sleep. I think I heard some rustle. Why didn't the dog wake me if I heard some rustle? Go back to sleep. Yeah, I'm hungry. That's fine. I've been hungry before. Been a lot more hungry than this. Up. Or I was already up? No. Feed the dog. And then wait for the dog to eat. Okay, you've had enough. Five miles an hour.
There's a Arctic Fox. I did not bring my paw board. Shame. Drop everything but my rock. Feed the dog. Throw the rock. Hit him. Just kick him. Okay. Skin him. Fine skin. Butcher him. One cut, as expected. This is silly. I, I don't like the way this is going. I'm going to take a break. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.